Owen Powell, uh, welcome to Gloucester. Um, you've been here a couple of days. How have you found it so far? Yeah, it's great, really uh, welcoming environment. All the guys are great. All the coaches have uh, made me feel very welcome and physio and strength and conditioning team seem really clued in and re really professional. So it seems to be a great place to be. And of course, it seems that you've arrived at a quite a good time because the treatment room looks fairly quiet at the moment. Yeah, it's pretty quiet. I, uh, and on, 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 uh, in addition to that, also like the team's, you know, going for a double really, uh, which, you know, we can get We've got a top four in Premiership in our sights and we've also got a Challenge Cup in our sights as well. So it's a really good atmosphere around the place and that married with very low injury rate is, is brilliant. And we obviously touch wood when we say low injury rate because of course at one point earlier in the season Gloucester had 21 injuries. Things can change quite quickly, can't they? Yeah, that's just the nature of the game. I suppose when you watch a rugby game you're, you're probably a bit surprised that not all 30 players don't get injured, you know, but... Luckily, that the guys are really well conditioned here, uh, really strong, really powerful. So hopefully, we we maintain these decent injury rates. Now, of course, you've spent a number of years down at Bristol Rugby, and you worked with Bristol when they were in the Premiership last year. So, so what was it that tempted you to move up the M5 and join Gloucester? Well, I suppose Gloucester, as I as I alluded to, are a team that are competing both in Europe and you know at the business end of the Premiership, and just like any other like person in this in this game, be it a player or a backroom staff, I'm ambitious and. I really, really want to win some silverware with whatever club, and I think Gloucester affords me the opportunity to do that. And of course, there's at least five games left to go for Premiership and the European quarter-final. But in a funny sort of way, you're going to be just as busy in the off-season, aren't you, preparing for next season? Yeah, well, hopefully we don't have too many uh, people to sew up uh, during the off-season, but uh, definitely, yeah, especially getting my feet under the table, just you know, planning out long-term strategies for some of the players that are carrying knocks, etc. Pre-season is a really, really good period of time just to, you know, get a couple of wins with some players that may be carrying like niggles throughout the season. For now, it's just roll your sleeves up, get stuck in, and get through to the end of the season. Yeah, this is it. Well, I mean, that's one way of putting it. But I suppose my mindset would be just embrace every every day that we're in here. You know, there's a massive opportunity on the table here for Gloucester, and hopefully everybody can dig in and really embrace it and bring the best out in everybody. Owen, thanks for your time and welcome to the club. Right, cheers. Thanks very much. Mm -hmm.